Planck's constant apparatus. Rip that off. Risk assessment, UV light, do so you don't look in the source which is coming from here. So you do the cable. So this power supply is for the mercury lamp. So here it goes. So there are our mercury lamps powered up. And now we have a, um, a shutter uh, which is, um, protects the lamp. It's built, built by the department. And then we have another power output here for the ammeter. goes into here. So this goes into here, these two into the back of the diode, this goes into the back of the diode, this is the ammeter, this into the power supply, this controls the shutter. And then the power supply. This is the power supply for the lamp. Power supply for the power supply. And this is for the shutter. Right, so let's turn on. Turn on, turn on, turn on. So here's our photo diet. 
here we've got some uh, filters. I'm going to remove this. Now, this little device here is a shutter and um, I put the filter on here and this and you can see the ultraviolet on my finger maybe. Alright, so now what we have is ultraviolet light passing through this filter. I mean, the filter has um, the wavelength of this filter This goes in here. This is an ammeter which is actually reading to 10 to the minus 13 of an amp. So we don't touch this calibration, we're just going to leave it out because this is for measuring. Uh, and now we adjust this until we get zero volts, which there's uh, no current showing on here because all the electrons that are being emitted by the metal surface are being attracted back to it by this back EMF. So let's, uh, let's adjust this. So we're looking for the current to go to zero. So the current zero and our back EMF is 0.628 and that is for 5365 nanometers One point eight three four. Sorry, one point six three four. One point six three four. And this was for three hundred and sixty five nanometers. The next one is five hundred and forty six. So this is 0.611 volts and that's for 546 nanometers. The next one is 436 nanometers. So we're getting, it's a bit unstable this, 1.104 volts <clears throat> and that's 436 nanometers. This is 405 nanometers. So that's 1.35 volts and that was for 405 nanometers and the last one we have this is 577 <coughs> and this is 0.499 volts and that was for 577 nanometers. So <coughs> to take this apart make sure everything's turned off and plug your power supplies
to find their way on the back. This needs to go to the end. Okay, well. 